Hi, I'm presenting our online training course on ultrasonic testing level one and two. So if you are um, planning to become a UT level one or two, or even wants to know the basic of level one, uh, ultrasonic testing, this is an excellent course. It has seven hours of video, 42 lectures, 250 mock practice questions, 280 flashcards with four months, 24 seven course access. Now, why is the e-learning course? Uh, to be directly qualified for ASNT UT level two certification, you should complete 80 hours of organized training and also pass general, specific and practical exam. Now, according to ASNT, ASNT TC1A 2022 edition, uh, this organized training can include instructor-led training, personalized virtual instructor, computer-based training or web-based training. And the current online training course meets the requirement of ASNT, ASNT C1A and ANT uh, ASNT CP105, which is about uh, topical outlines for qualification of non-destructive testing personnel for organized training. It also, this course includes a general and a specific exam. And what you learn is uh, about NDT certification, sample procedure and report, written practice, all about ultrasonic testing, welding processes and defects, ASM section five, article one, general requirements, article four, UT, metallurgy, manufacturing and fabrication, casting and forging, the basics, welding processes the eight popular ones welding issues and it has 14 sets of flashcards five sets of practice question and finally the general and a specific exam paper we'll go through our course content to explain to you in detail how uh, what you're going to learn and once you have completed the training course and passed the general and specific exam you shall be issued a certificate of achievement that certifies that you have met the training requirements for ASNT uh, UT level two um, and uh, according to ASNT, ASNT C1A and ANSI CP 105 both 2020 edition. Now what happens if uh, you fail the theory papers? If you fail it, the minimum pass grade is 70%. Your course shall be reset, which means you are required to repeat the course but free of charge. And if you wish to be certified as an internationally recognized ASNT UT level two, you can then register for one of our one day practical classroom training and exam across the board. Obviously additional charges will apply. Now remember that you have already, by going through this course, you have already passed the general and specific exam. You already covered, be certified that you already covered the um, at the training requirement according to ASNT, uh, the 80 hours of training, and, uh, and so this would be just one day practical exam, uh, practical uh, classroom training plus exam uh, in Viva with the conventional training, which is uh, 80 hours, so 10 days of classroom training plus one day for general and specific and practical. So you will be saving a lot of time and money in this regard. You know, the time taken off the work, the travel time, the, you know, logistic total charges, hotel charges, etc. cetera. Uh, this is 120 days, 24 seven course access and online support via WhatsApp and Zoom. So if you have any queries, you can write to us, inspectortraining.com or simply click on this button and I am Ash, I'm leading the NDT level three team for designing all these, our courses. And uh, there will be somebody here who would answer your technical question or something that you did not understand. That also helps us to revise our courses, um, uh, yeah, make it even better. Uh, so you're actually helping us by asking, raising any technical queries practically, we welcome it. And if you have any general queries, access issues, payment issues, this was for general queries. You can directly add it to the cart, go to PayPal and buy this course. Now, and you would have automatic, automatic access 
and then uh, once you finish the course the certificate will be issued automatically to you any problem what's up email us i will be happy to help let's see what this course contains it has uh, the first module starts with NDT certification what is level one two three the trainings the of level one and two and three the eye test etc and the and then it comes a flashcard here and uh, then on module two we'll be going through the sample written practice and question you can see that this is a flashcard the highlights of asntc one a and uh, then we go to sample written practice certification procedure um, and the typical certification procedure will go through it and all the, our courses comes with videos so um, it's very user friendly and we go through all this and we explain what this means plus uh, you've got the written format of that then the next one is sample procedure and report so we go through a, a sample procedure our procedure should look like how it should be issued, what are the differences, standards, scope, etc., definitions, responsibility, personal qualification, and the actual procedure, how the equipment should be set, and the actual sample report, which comes at the end here, uh, how to fill in the report. Uh, on Model 3, it is entirely based on uh, application training certification, um, ultrasound, wave properties and uh, chapter 3 is about uh, typical UT equipment uh, eco pulse chapter 4 is about sizing techniques 6 decibel drop 20 decibel drop equal amplitude uh, technique and then on chapter 5 we'll be talking about um, detecting relevant discontinuities you can see here we talk about all these parts and uh, what they all means and uh, excessive part about detecting the relevant discontinuity like porosity, shrinkage cracks, you know, slag inclusion um, and etc. And then chapter 6 it talks about uh, thickness measurements then on module 4 we will be talking about the other introduction and then terms and definition on of ASVA Section 5, the general terms and the terms specific to UT. And then we'll talk about Article 1, the general requirements, and then Article 4, uh, UT uh, for wells. And then there is an extensive flashcard that you can see here, 14 sets of them. Then on Module 5, we'll be going through the basic methodology, casting and forging, and manufacturing and fabrication, and then the eight popular eight building processes. On module six, there is a comprehensive PowerPoint presentation on, uh, so these are the flashcards as you can see, um, and uh, comprehensive building processes. Uh, uh, that is eight popular building process, and this all, each and every single model comes with a, a video, with lots of pictures, with videos, and uh, visual inspection, pipe and plate inspection. Let's look at the pipe and plate inspection and see it's all a PowerPoint presentation with lots of pictures that's coming. And uh, as you can see, it's talking about all the terms, what they mean. And uh, our model seven, uh, we have uh, five practice questions and uh, these questions they are uh, they can be you know, graded and timed and then uh, so this one is like 40 something question and 70 minutes for example and uh, you can flag them off and these are for practice let's uh, start one of them and see how that works well uh, is about the general knowledge and you can see you can jump from one to another you can flag it off you can uh, if you want to come back to this again and you can 
choose your answer or also see the answer if it is a correct answer right here or not and then it also explains why this is the right answer or that other one is wrong answer and uh, so after you have done the four sets uh, five sets of uh, this question then the actual general or specific exams 40 for general and 25 24 specific and you can do it only once so once uh, you have started the course and once you started you have to finish it and you should get 70 percent great if you don't get it don't worry we will renew the course for you but it's very very user friendly i'm sure all of you will pass this exam and uh, so that was all about uh, our course any question please let us know uh, what's applied technical and general queries or write to us and we shall be happy to help and you can buy directly via paypal so your payment is safe we don't uh, hold your card details it all goes in a safe transaction to paypal you can add to cart and go straight away to the course have access once you finish it straight away you have um, your certification and uh, any issue please you, you can always contact us 24 7. thank you